Jimmy Gang, man. Another one bites the dust. Listen, man. Shout out to my guy KD, man. That's my goal. All I'm going to say is he would never. My boy KD would never. But it hits pretty close to home, man. His teammate, DeAndre Ayton, man. Listen, he is cuffing up a fan's baddie. Yes, I told you. A fan's baddie. You heard me correctly, man. Shout out to Cat Leia, man. I'm actually proud of her. I actually know Cat Leia. We from the same building in Patterson Projects. So shout out to Cat Leia, man. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna give y'all a little story time at the end of this video. But listen, man. DeAndre Ayton, man. He cuffing Cat Leia. The big booty blow up dog demon, man. I ain't gonna lie. She look good. I still smash. She got a lot of work done. Way too much work for me to cuff. But I would definitely blow her back out. Like, I be seeing these rapper niggas, Joe Budden, all these celebrity blue, blue check niggas, all in her, her likes and comments and all that. Like, yeah, she doing good for herself these days, man. She came a long way from the third floor of the projects, you heard? But listen, man, this is the story. DeAndre Ayton, man, he has been seen, spotted, cuffing, holding hands, toasting wine, brushing the hair of an OnlyFans demon, man. Yes, we talking about Cat Leia. The same Cat Leia that was just sucking my son Jay Critch up a year ago. Like, literally just sucking my son Jay Critch up, putting posts on, on Instagram. Like, if I wasn't on birth control, I would have a hundred baby daddies. And the nigga Jay Critch came in the comments and said, I be baby daddy number 10. She said, no, you be the baby daddy number one. You know what I mean? Like, Cat Leia is definitely, you know what I'm saying, one of them. You feel me? When you think of a, a, a demon, a smut, a, one of them joint, basically a sex worker, bro. She just making money out here. At the end of the day, my nigga, I can't hate on it. She a content creator. I'm a content creator. She just creating content out of her body. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, that ass is fat, my boys. That thing is fat. Any one of y'all watching this video, hit that thing. But y'all wouldn't make the mistake of cuffing her. And y'all niggas ain't no MVP picks. I mean, well, neither is DeAndre. But y'all niggas ain't in the NBA playing for the Phoenix Suns. Nigga, teammates with Kevin Durant. You know what I'm saying? My goal, Kevin Durant. Like, matter of fact, I feel bad for Kevin Durant. Like, he got to turn around and look at his homie. Look at his homie in a family section of the game. And he see a, a OnlyFans demon. Like, a joint that done swallowed three dicks on camera. You know what I'm saying? That's what he got to see when he look in the family section at the Phoenix Sun Games. That's what Kevin Durant got to witness, bro. She in the same section with Kevin Durant mama. She in the same section with Kevin Durant mama, bro. Her OnlyFans blow-up dog. Now, listen. Like I said, though, shout out to Kat Leia, though, bro. She came a long way from Patterson Projects. We all did, you know what I'm saying? But she was on the third floor. I was on the second. I'm going to give y'all a quick story time, you know what I'm saying? This is a little quick story time from Jim. Back in the day, bro, Patterson Projects, man, I was a young nigga running wild. Yes, I was trying to hit, but I'm not going to lie. Cat, Catherine was what we called her. Bro, she was wild ditzy, wild dumb, you know what I'm saying? Like, very dumb, you know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure she's still that way. When you see her on Instagram Live and all that, she be seeing wild dumb still. Like, whenever I pop in to see what she's talking about, dumb shit, you know what I mean? But she was wild ditzy and wild dumb, bro. So this is what happened. One day... She was going to play a trick on me. We was all cool. Me, her, my homie Tremaine, his sister Tamara, and their little sister Takara, along with other friends that we had, including my, my guy, bro, Heck, who apparently supposedly smashed, but she said he didn't, but I believe him. He smashed, you know what I mean? She probably going to lie. But anyway, long story short, one day, I'm coming up to my bro Tremaine crib. Cat Leia is already there. She already in the crib. You know what I'm saying? We cut in school or whatever. Cause we all used to cut school together. Like I said, I was trying to smash. You know what I mean? Back in the day. But I stopped trying to smash after this day. Cause I knew it was never going to happen. Even though it probably could have happened. But I was young and dumb and didn't have the game to keep pursuing after this. But anyway. So one day we all go into my man main crib. We go into his sister room. Like now she hiding from me. Catherine is hiding. Cause I guess she going to jump out and scare me. So, Catherine, we all playing this whole jump out scare game back in the day, you know what I mean? So, she gonna jump out and scare the shit out of me, you know what I'm saying? Like, which, like, we always do that to each other. So, I come in the room, but when I come in the room, bro, first thing I say is like, yo, bro, Catherine get me tight, bro. She dumb as shit, bro. She's wild dumb. Tell me why she said this. Like, bro, something had just happened earlier that day. 
that she did something so dumb and it got me so aggravated. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mind you, this is younger Cat Leia. Like, I'm a younger nigga. Like, we all the same age, you know what I'm saying? But she younger at the time, you know what I'm saying? So even though she looked good and all that, she a good looking fire Dominican joint. Like, you know, she, she ain't OD bad. Like, with that big old fat ass, you know what I'm saying? Sticking that joint out and taking dick and all that something to cock on camera and all that. So. I didn't have the same visual of her. She was just Catherine from the hood. Feel me? She was just cat from upstairs who I want to hit. Who I would hit if she threw it at me and make it easy. Feel me? So I come in the room talking crazy. Like, yo, she's stupid as fuck, bro. She just got me tight, bro. She did this. She almost got me caught up with this dumb. Because she want to be dumb. Just running her mouth on some ditzy shit, bro. I told y'all keep her from around me, bro. She wild ditzy. Blue mind. Bro, tell me why Catherine listening to me the whole time. Behind, like, a little curtain type joint. You know what I'm saying? Hiding. Tell me why she come out, bro. Start crying, bro. Mad, sad, like, <laughs> oh my god, Lori. Like, why did you have to? Like, like, bro, start crying. You know what I'm saying? Mad, like, she really upset. Cause I'm, I ain't gonna lie. I was going off on her, thinking she not there. Like, I wouldn't have said this to her face, cause I wouldn't have made her cry. Like, I wouldn't have came at her so hard. Cause I know she's sensitive and all that. You know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't have did that. You feel me? But, bro, this day, my nigga, I didn't know. They didn't tell me that she was gonna jump out and scare me. So she told me, shh. Don't tell him I'm here, I'ma jump out of scam. So I didn't know, bro. So I go off on him, my nigga, you know what I'm saying? I say all this, but I did apologize. I'm like, yo, my fault, bro. I'm just mad, like, bro, you just got me caught up because you running your mouth. I told you, like, stop running your mouth so much that you gonna get niggas caught up, like. So I apologize and all, like, you know what I'm saying? We made up, we was cool. But after that, though, it was never the same. Like, she always was a little bit like, you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, he really was shitting on me. This really what he think about me. Like, she even always came to me and said, like, you really think I'm dumb? Like, oh, man, she, yo, she used to come and show me her grades. This how, like, like, she wanted to prove to me that she wasn't dumb. Like, she was dead come and show me her grades. Like, look, I get good grades. I'm not dumb. Like, I just be saying dumb stuff. I'm like, yo, you got it, cat. Like, it's all good. You know what I'm saying? But we was all young at the time, bro. We was like high school age, cutting school and all that. You know what I'm saying? Patterson Projects in the Bronx. You know what I mean? Shout out to Cat Leia though, bro. She made it out of Patterson Projects, and now she got a simp ball player paying her bills. I'm pretty sure she up a couple hundred thousand, man. Shout out to her. This video is not even to shit on her. Like me and Cat go back to Patterson Projects, so I actually want to show her some love at the end. Like you know, I had to make my jokes and talk shit. I mean, ah, but yeah, she a blow up doll. Yeah, she gets smashed on camera. But listen, some of y'all favorite porn stars, you know what I'm saying, is out here doing the same thing, like, we ain't mad at them, nigga, I got a favorite P-star that I watch on Twitter all the time, her name is Baby Jimmy, Baby Jimmy, one of my favorite P-stars, I respect her, get your money how you get it, so I respect Cat Lady too, get your money how you get it, honey, I ain't mad at you, you still look good, you know what I'm saying, that ass is way fatter than it is naturally, cause you wouldn't add this stuff, but I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna give you this, she always had the cake, Cat Lady never was like, didn't have ass, like she always had cake, you know what I mean, she really probably didn't even need to go do all the extra that she did, it's a little bit outrageous now, let me know what y'all think, is it outrageous to y'all, or is it perfect to y'all, like, to me it's a little bit outrageous, but I still hit, like, I still crash, you know what I mean, like, I ain't sitting here saying that like I wouldn't hit, because if she threw it at me, nigga, today I'm hitting, nigga, but listen, to the homie, um, you know what I'm saying, DeAndre, my nigga, watch your pockets, KD, talk to your teammate, let that nigga know, watch his pockets, you know what I'm saying, don't get caught up on those Zion stuff. I don't think she's going to go and do, go do with what Shorty did to Zion because she a good girl at heart. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, she is a sexual deviant. Obviously, she an OnlyFans chick. But at the same time, bro, we love that. I love a sexual deviant. So I'm not mad at it. I'm going. Let me know what y'all think, Jimmy Gang. I'm going. I'm just glad it's not my GOAT, Kevin Durant. Because if it was my GOAT, Kevin Durant, bro, I'd be on here tight. I would be on here tight, my nigga. I'm telling you right now. So I'm just glad it ain't KD. I'm going. Bro, she really in the family section with Kevin Durant, mama. Think about that, bro. Think about that.